five worst concept cars from the last 10 years. A concept car, also known as a prototype, is a car designed in order to showcase something new in the world of the automobile industry. It is made to test people's reaction to the new design, styling and technology. While on one hand, it can be very interesting to see new designs, features, engines and other innovations, on the other hand, sometimes the whole idea can just go terribly wrong. And that has been the case with some of the worst concept cars in history. So we decided that in this video, we should go over 5 worst concept cars from the last 10 years. Number 1. Lexus LF SA Lexus has chosen an interesting way of celebrating their 25th anniversary by making something new and controversial, and that's how LF SA was created. It was presented at the 2015 Geneva Motor Show, and the opinions were very divided. Some people loved it, but most of the people hated it. The idea behind it was to make something small and stylish for the European roads with tight parking spots. Being only 11.3 feet long and about half that wide, we must admit that it is indeed a very small and compact car. But the stylish part is up for discussion since it's hard to see anything stylish about it. It actually resembles something that would belong at the Star Wars set. Number 2. Chrysler Imperial It seems like this concept has been a part of some kind of contest of who can come up with the largest and most impractical car possible. If stretching a car was a competing category, Chrysler Imperial concept would be a clear shot winner. If you thought Chrysler 300's 120 inch wheelbase was already stretched enough, it might come to you as a surprise that Chrysler decided to take it one step further and the Imperial's wheelbase was stretched 3 inches over that. The overall length is actually 17 over the 300's. Not only was it longer, it was also nearly 6 inches taller. Number 3. Ford Sinus Ford Sinus concept was basically one big metal square of a car. It was based on the European Ford Fiesta and it was actually an SUV type vehicle with a kind of armory look to it. Truth be told, it looked like a huge metal safe on wheels since the tail cover was completely windowless and it even had a 4 spoke spin handle. Although this concept seemed pretty massive, it was actually designed to fit an urban environment. However, it would be hard to imagine somebody using it to pick up kids from school or to go buy groceries at the nearest store. It really looked like something that would belong to a bank, police or army rather than an urban housewife. Number 4. Suzuki Mobile Terrace To put it simply, this concept is just wrong. Everything about it looks wrong. It was presented at the 2003 Tokyo Motor Show and it sort of seemed like a greenhouse on wheels, slightly resembling something like the world's strangest glass microbus with the bifurcated doors in the middle. When you look at it, it is kind of hard to tell in which direction it's supposed to be driven. It looks like it could go both ways. Number 5. Scion Hako The Scion Hako was a concept car presented by the automaker Scion, Toyota's youth brand at the 2008 New York International Auto Show. Scion is actually quite hip with the kids, but a thing can only be so edgy before it goes over the edge, and that is exactly what happened with this particular concept. Everything seems to be too much. The box is too boxy, straight lines are too straight, the robotic look to it looks overly robotic, etc. It has been said that the inspiration behind this car was the growing popularity of American vintage style between young Japanese trendsetters. However, in reality, this is really hard to see. Thank you for joining us back at the Alpha Club. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more amazing videos. We have also handpicked these videos that we think you'll like watching next and we'll see you back tomorrow.